Hi, this is Jason from New Rise Media and I'm speaking to Bartek from Zortrax and I'm standing in front of a bike, but this isn't any normal bike. The entire body has been 3D printed. So can you tell me a little bit more about it, please? Yes, of course. Uh, it was 3D printed from uh, 180 parts. Yeah. Uh, we can, uh, we split them together and uh, post-process them. Uh, Almost uh, everything is uh, printed from uh, Z-hips. Yeah. Uh, we have also some elements printed from Z-glass. Yeah. Uh, so transparent uh, elements, right? Uh, like uh, lights. Yeah. Uh, and the construction under uh, this body uh, was printed in Altrad. Yeah. Uh, and this is completely new design of original bike. Yeah. So. So how We're long very did, proud of it. So how long did it take to design it then? How long did it take uh, the printing process? The entire uh, process uh, took uh, about two months. Yeah. And the printing process uh, on multiple devices, on multiple 3D printers, took yeah. us uh, about two weeks. So two weeks to literally build a bike. To print the bike. To print and the bike then and to then to yeah. put them together. Yeah. Wow. Um, so, do you see this being a future for 3D printing in transportation then? Do you see 3D printing cars, bikes in the future? Uh, prototypes, functional yeah. prototypes, yes. And uh, we think that uh, it's enable uh, multiple industries for redesigning. Yeah. So, they can design something and then uh, invent some improvements to it. Yeah. And that's the future, we think. All right, awesome. Well, thank you very much for taking thank the time to talk to us. Cheers. Bye.